What is the most important sector of IT to understand to actually be a good tech? That's a great question. I'm gonna break this into different domains. Okay, firstly, we have the tier one support type domain generalist. Then we have networking, and we have cloud, and then we have security. Obviously, these things are all intertwined, and they go together, so it's tough to judge one and separate the others, but I'm gonna try my best. And I think it goes in this order. Firstly, you need to have a basis for IT. You need to understand what a domain is. You need to understand how things authenticate to a domain. You need to understand how GPO works, what a network is, what being domain joined is, and then probably how that all works into the cloud. With Active Directory, you have AD Sync, or I guess Entra Connect, how it's called now. How does that sync up to the cloud? What can you do with cloud objects and what can you do with on-prem objects and what's the difference? All important things to know. But first and foremost, most importantly, is being a domain generalist, understanding how software works, understanding how everything fits in together. After that, I think that the most, 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 most important is networking. I think understanding networking is so important to actually take your IT skills to that next level. If you understand networking at a deep level, what, a, what DHCP is, what a default gateway is, how subnetting works and what the actual first host and last host on a network is, if you understand this, you start to become an IT beast. You start to be that guy that people come to you and say, hey, Jake, this doesn't make sense to me. Can you help? And you look at it, you can see that something's wrong. A number's wrong in the subnet or the default gateway is wrong. And you can say, hey, I can see why this is wrong. And it's almost like you're a wizard. I'm no network wizard, okay? But when I go to the network engineers and they're able to use data and use commands to find solutions to issues that I never would have been able to think about, it's actually like magic. It's the most beautiful thing in IT, in my estimation. Now, people hate networking. Understand, that which you most need is often found where you least wanna look. If you hate networking, I think it's absolutely something that you should be studying, you should be trying to get better at because it really will take your IT abilities to that next level. Okay, so we have domain generalist, networking. After those two, I'm gonna put security first, and then cloud. Understanding in a security context what you can do and what you can't do, or rather, what you should do and what you shouldn't do and what the implications of that are is part of going to that next level. Having a bigger picture of, hey, is this ultimately gonna help my security posture or is this gonna hurt my security posture? And making those type of informed decisions with security in mind is really where cybersecurity is important. You're probably not gonna be in Linux hacking people's devices or thinking like a hacker or unless you're dedicated working in cybersecurity, you're probably not going to be doing very much device isolation and removing malware and things like that. But understanding the security implications of, hey, what happens if I add this public IP to trusted locations or to named locations in conditional access? That type of thing is really important. Hey, should I disable MFA for this VPN user that's in India? Probably not. It's an easy question, but there are many things where it's, is this really a good idea? Should I be giving out information that I'm giving out? Should I be releasing this email that I'm releasing? Am I 100% sure that what's go what I think is going on is actually what's going on? So I'm gonna go security there, and then cloud in terms of understanding how everything fits together, super duper important in that regard. Once you get more cloudy, cloud hosted things, that's where the future's going. It's important. It's important to understand Azure or AWS, but you really can't get to that point. Much like being a security practitioner, you can't get to that point until you understand being a domain generalist and networking as well. So that's how everything fits in my estimation. And that's what you should be trying to do to get really good at IT if you wanna be really good at IT. Once you get those basics, you can move forward and go more specialized towards things that you want. No. What do you guys think? Have a good day.